Is day trading your gateway to financial freedom? That's where you're the boss. You're earning potentially huge profits from home. You know, let's talk about that and the realities behind it. So day trading, just buying and selling instruments like stocks, futures, to profit from short-term price movements all within the same trading day. And it's actually a pretty popular strategy. It offers you some independence, flexibility, and the chance to capitalize on the volatility of the market. But it is a double-edged sword. There are significant risks and there is potential for substantial losses, especially when you're first starting out. So the pros, there's that freedom and the flexibility because you can work from anywhere. You can set your own schedule, depending on the market, of course, and make decisions based on your own analysis and your instincts. And this level of autonomy, it's a major draw for people that are looking for an alternative to that nine to five grind where you punch in and you punch out every profit potential. There's opportunity for substantial profits. You take advantage of these short-term price fluctuations and the market overreactions. And traders that are skilled in it, they can capitalize on these movements and potentially earn significant returns in a single trading session. And there's no overnight risk. Unlike long-term investors, swing traders, day traders aren't exposed to those overnight market fluctuations because you close all your positions before the market closes. But there's cons. It's high risk. It's inherently risky. There's no guarantee of earning a single dime. And it's common for new traders to experience big losses because they're just learning to master their approach. I mean, that depends on their approach having an edge. And those initial financial losses, again, most day traders face initial financial setbacks because they're learning. And to achieve that consistent profitability, it's going to require significant time, effort, and a deep understanding of your strategy and risk management and capital requirements. In day trading, to make a living from it, you got to have a substantial amount of capital to start. And you got to think about the associated taxation complexities that can be challenging for people. You know, traders have to have sufficient funds to not only weather potential losses, but to pay for their platforms and even set aside some funds for tax. And your success is tied to market conditions. It's directly tied to the prevailing market condition. That can be unpredictable. And volatility, you know, got periods of low volatility or unfavorable market trends, that can impact your profitability. So for example, if you're trading breakouts at a time when there's little follow through to the upside, it's gonna be a tough way for you to make a living. So do you have another approach to use in the environment that you're facing? You know, that's something you wanna consider. And to succeed in day trading, People use various strategies. They're scalping, momentum trading, you know, breakouts, and range trading. And these approaches require planning, research, and the ability to react to market fluctuations. And there's a term I heard a while back, and it was to have a trade factory. So there's a process of doing things on a daily basis. An example would be trading breakouts on short-term timeframes between 9.30 and 11 a.m. You already know the tickers you're going to look at from the homework that you did after hours. And you know exactly what to do if that setup fires off. There's no guesswork. There's no second guessing. To succeed at day trading, it also demands a solid understanding of technical analysis inside of your trading approach, risk management, and emotional control. And of course, you want to have access to reliable technology, right? So, yeah, day trading does offer potential for some big profits, but you have to understand the financial implications. You need to be prepared for these potential losses, especially in the initial stages. And you need to have sufficient capital to weather the market fluctuations that happen. And again, the tax that's associated with day trading, it can be challenging to figure that out. So you're going to have to navigate whatever tax laws and regulations are in your area. So listen, at the end of the day, day trading is a high risk, high reward endeavor, but it does offer independence and the potential for significant profits. But it's not a guaranteed path to wealth and your success is going to require dedication, discipline and understanding of the market and a trade factory as we just talked about. Thanks for watching. We'll talk to you soon.